Howdy, Mojave D here. I'm doing well. I hope you're doing well. Um, welcome to episode three of The Fungus Among Us, um, where we lost Tess um, in the last episode. Uh, she valiantly stood her ground uh, to uh, buy us time, uh, Joel and Ellie, time to, to get out of there. And, uh, uh, but you know, um, any of you would have done the same thing. You know, you're bitten, you're in fact, you're infected within a few hours, you are going to be gone anyway. Uh, what is going to be in your place isn't you. That's going to be this fungus, um, thing. So, um, the alternative would be to go with your friends. Don't tell them. But guess what? In a few hours, they're going to find out when you start to turn, and then you just put them in the very, very um, unfortunate uh, and miserable position of having to kill you, being killed by your friends. So what you did was the right thing, and I think every one of you would have done the same. Um, so I, I don't want to tell any stories or anything. Uh, uh, well, I do, but I won't. <laughs> so I want to get right into it. Uh, and... Uh, uh, yeah, I'm being cantankerous. So, you know, yeah. So, uh, cantankerous old people are really easy to deal with, man. All you got to do is feed us and we'll go, to, we'll go take a nap. No problem. Um, I cleared the Capitol building, I thought, and we were on our way out. Well, actually, I was trying to find Tess so we could pay our last respects. And then uh, some more bad agents uh, showed up. So that's, I'm in a pickle, and um, we did get a, a rifle. Let me get my big head out of here. Um, we did get a rifle, but I'm not sure. Or I should say I'm wondering what it's loaded with, because it didn't seem to hit very hard. I mean, that, that, a, a bolt-action rifle, that should be a, a 308. Or a 306, but it didn't hit like a 308 or a 306. So I don't know what they have it loaded with. I and mean, I had to shoot that one guy in the face twice. <laughs> I don't care if you're wearing a helmet. <clears throat> you get hit in the face with a 308, you're done. You're, you know, I had to hit him twice. So, uh, why am I talking about that? Oh, I also believe that I have fixed the sound being too low coming from the game. Apparently, that is a problem that occurred with uh, PlayStation games um, and people who try to make uh, videos of the game, that the, the sound from the game was too low. And my son sent me a, a, um, a link uh, that I can follow that shows how to improve that. So I've done that. So um, I want to do a sound check real early on. Look at the beauty of this game. I mean, those are, I feel like I could just reach out and just, and feel those uh, curtains and feel the, the, the paint and the plaster cracking off the wall there. Okay, let's, uh, I also turned I, I darkened it back up. I darkened the um, atmosphere again, um, just responding to comments in the comment section. It was too dark, I felt, on the first episode, so I lightened it up, and then people saying it's too light on the second episode. Here's where we are. And I'm really not happy. You know what I want to know? It's out of ammo. I was going to say, I want to know what kind of ammo I have. Um, right there, there, oh shite. Okay, here's what we'll do. I'm gonna take a quick break. I'm gonna do a sound check and I'll be right back at you. So smoke them if you got them while you can. Okay, I'm back. Now I was thinking about Ellie's situation. We'll talk about that in a minute because I need to focus. Uh, because I don't want to die. And I didn't record enough to see if the game sound is any good. Oh, crap. Hold your 
position. I'm not hearing anything. Oh crap. I, I did this really bad and I'm not hearing sound. I'm not getting sound. Ammo. I'm out of ammo all over the place. I gotta. I'm gonna get this guy. I'm not. Okay, let's start again. And I gotta do a sound check. Something's wrong with the sound. Dag nab it. I thought it was working, man. I'm um, gonna. Dang it. Okay, I took one down. Shoot, I, I didn't. I forgot to turn the record back on. I'm not getting sound. Uh, something's wrong. Well, that's wrong. Keeps moving. Can't blame him, huh? I'm completely out of ammo. Um, why did I switch guns? Back, can I get the pistol, please? And this is it. I only have two rounds? Yeah, I choked a guy out over here. I need ammo. Oh, great. I would like to have rifle ammo. Great. No, 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 no. I wanted to reload this one. But I'm not getting sound, guys. I, I can't hear. Anything. Oh, I should probably put the headset on, huh? There's two down there. Uh, Under okay, okay. I'm not getting sound. Um, I need to... Uh, I need to stop recording and see what the heck the sound is going, going on with the sound. Shoot him, I can I can get him. Great. Ammo. I don't know why the sound isn't working. There's another guy over there. Okay. Okay. So just two left? Gonna have armor. Uh, do I have a bottle? I have a Molotov. Is this the last guy? He's got a helmet. Is 
that everything? Is that everybody? Okay. Joel, so there's the exit. Where? Okay, before we do that, I have got to do a sound check. I, something is wrong with the sound. I am so sorry. Uh, I'll be right back. Dang it. Well, that was an easy fix. I just had to put my headsets on. But still, the sound from the game is not very loud. But I, I maxed it. What I want to do before we exit, she said there's the exit. So I'm assuming right here. And we can get out. But I want to sweep the building one more time. Um, because I can't believe I, I'm out of rifle ammo. And I want to know what kind of ammo they're putting in the um, rifle. Um, well, that and I just want some more. I think they only gave me like 10 rounds. And it didn't seem like... That's the burn guy, so I'm back in that room. I need to go back... I need to get upstairs. Um, to where we killed all those guys and try to find rifle ammo. And it doesn't look like I can get back there. Looks like I'm closed off from the rest of the building. I can only stay in this section. Ah, cool. Uh, let's take that. And, uh, okay, so doing another sweep at least gained me that. And thank you guys in the comment section. I know how to sprint now. <laughs> but I, I can't get out of this section of the building. I mean, we got into it. There has to be a way to get back the way we came. Oh, man. I wanted to go back to that other section where we killed a whole big bunch of them. And, uh, check for <laughs> rifle ammo. Okay, where's the exit? You would think there'd be things in automobiles. Oh, right there. Okay. You'd think there'd be things in the automobiles. But, um, well, maybe after 20 years sitting there, there isn't. What? The oh, well, run, 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 run. Holy crap. on me automatically. Here. 
He was a tough one. Shit, behind me. Damn it. Nothing. Ellie, watch your mouth, girl. Shouldn't be talking like that. Looking for anything to loot? Hey, uh, I can't swim. Oh, find time to tell me. We'll figure something out. We'll figure something out. I like Joel. He's a man of few words. But, what he says... So we need some flotation device for her. Uh, like what? I need I need to make a raft for her of some kind. Whoa! What happened? Oh, I dove. Uh, the the B button the zero button. Can I get back up? <laughs> it wants me drown now. So I just figured out how to kill myself is what I did. I just figured out a new way to die. Is there a way up? Up. How does it get up? Up. Up, son. Up. Whew. Wow. So I just accidentally hit the zero button and he dove. Cool. But now where's Ellie? And she can't swim, so she's way back yonder. She's way back behind me. Ellie? Right? Where is she? I'm fine. Hey, how'd you get over there? How'd she get over there? What you got, girl? What'd she say? Where the hell is this guy? I'm reading the last paragraph. I've been waiting here for over two hours, sweating bullets. I keep thinking I'm seeing something move in the shadows. Feels like a stalker is going to jump out at me any second. Your contact is a dude named Frank. Um... Here, let's do it this way. He's the guy on the outside I've been trading with. He want he wants into Boston. QZ. Quarantine zone. Meet him in the Park Street exit of the subway station. Right by the Capitol building. Well, we just left there. Am I supposed to go down here? You're not gonna leave me here, right? No. Just stay put. Oh, I can dive here? Wow! Oh, do I want to dive? Uh, whoa, look at all that stuff. Um, um, get up, get up, boy. Get up. Don't drown. I'm going to drown before I can collect all this stuff. Okay, he's got to get out. He's dying. Up, 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 up. Oh, great, I just killed myself. 
Uh, there was a bunch of stuff down there, though. Okay. Continue. Where are you going to bring me to? Here? Do we have to do him again? No. Okay. So there's a bunch of stuff down here. Look, it still works. Just stay put. What did she say? The work? Not going anywhere. What did she say? Okay, so we dive, but I have to go back this way. We gotta do this quick. We gotta do this quick. Find that gear quick. Okay, not quick enough. Uh, I need to get back up. Okay. Up, 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 up. Okay. Okay. Uh, try again. Um, because there's stuff down there, man. It was through here. Okay, back out, please. Back out, 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 and up. Got it. Anything down there? It's a dead end. A ladder. I see a ladder across the way. Helmets. isn't going to help her float. Um, this will... Oh, no. I, I didn't mean to dive. Up. So my feet are on the ground here. I like him. Man, a few words. Be careful. I got you. Uh, uh, by the ladder? Uh, I got to get her square. I got to get her squared up. Uh, can you get up, girl? There. I can't hop on the raft. Why can't I get on? Oh, there you go. Good girl. I'll be right there, girl. I, I, I want to check something out. I saw something down here. I guess it's just floating debris. Perfect. Now what? Nothing in the lockers. We got to get out of here before clickers show up. Exit, blood, let's get out of here, uh, check this, oh, 
Oh, that goes up. All right, that that's our way out. I was thinking this would be. No, we got to go up. Stop. No entry. Nothing to interact with. Green. I see green. All right. Hey! Hey, look. Um, about Tess. Hey, never don't. Here's how this thing's gonna play out. You don't bring up Tess, ever. In fact, we just keep our histories to ourselves. Secondly. Don't tell anybody about your condition. They really think you're crazy or they'll try to kill you. And lastly, you do what I say when I say it. We clear? Sure. Repeat it. What you say goes. Pretty much. Good. <laughs> now there's a town a few miles north of here. There's a fella there that owes me some favors. Good chance he could get us a car. A car? Okay. Say what? Let's get a move on. A car? Oh, wow. Now, there we go. Wow. Yeah, it'll be faster to go through here. Lincoln. <sighs> An animal. What? A bird. I've never seen anything like this, that's all. You mean the woods? Yeah. Never walked in the woods. It's kind of cool. <laughs> Why don't you just take me back to my room? If she was up to the task, why'd she drop you off on us? Well, maybe she's better now. Kid, I don't mean to upset you, but your friend's chances of survival weren't too high to begin with. She's a lot tougher than it don't matter. Because I doubt I can get either one of us back into the city in one piece. Trust me. I wish there was some other option. I can't take the spade? I want the spade. Spade. That's a that's a trowel. We could use that trowel. Well, can I craft um, like whenever I want? So if I could craft something, would that open up space? I can make a Molotov. I can make health kits. I can make a shiv. We don't have any. I want a shiv. Okay, uh, R1, maximum health. I want maximum health. Don't care too much about that. Don't care too much about that. Don't care too much about that. Care a lot about that. Okay, what else can I do? Um, let's make another sh shift. And um, a Molotov might come in handy. Wouldn't hurt to make a, a med kit. Uh, now I can't make a Molotov. All right, so now can I pick up this uh, trowel? Well, they're saying it's a scissor. Do I need to heal? I don't think I do. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Who's she talking to?
No, <laughs> I hit the wrong button. Um, what I wanted to do was reload the weapon. And a car. He mentioned a car. And you see what I mean about him being a man of few words? His instructions to her. Tell her how it's going to be. <laughs> and then insisting that she repeat it. I like that. Make sure she understands. And before we go any further, I need to take a break and digest everything that's just happened. This is really getting better and better and better. I'll be right back at you. Smoke them if you got them. Okay. So, as I was pondering what he said about don't tell anybody about your condition. Hmm. Because they'll think you're crazy and want to kill you. Okay. What that translates to me is, why would they want to kill her? Well, they wouldn't believe her. And think she's been bitten and therefore has to be killed. Or, if the wrong people get a hold of her, Um, A.K.A. the government agents, the baddies, the bad, the bad agents. They might want to kill her to harvest her, whatever's inside of her. If it's in her blood, then they can just like I don't know. I don't know. I'm not a biologist, man. I'm not a scientist. Um, but there are scientists. With Margaret, who want to examine her, run tests. What if it's in her DNA? So it's in her DNA. So how would they harvest that? Does that have to come from stem cells? The only thing I know about stem cells is very little. I know not, I mean, there's a big controversy years back, a couple of years back, about. Uh, abortion clinics selling, harvesting baby parts for the stem cells and the scientists as well as for a worthy cause. And there's a whole moral argument going on there. Um, so can stem cells be harvested from a live person? I don't know. Um, it, or would they even have to go there in the first place? Um, lots of questions here. So it's not just, so we're, obviously you have to keep her out of the hands of the wrong people. And do the wrong people know about her condition? I don't know. Well, we have a circle, there's a hint. But, on the, on the other thing was, when I was looking at this, and an R1 over to these different maps, like the patrol route map, the military pamphlet runner. Do not let these swarm you. Stalker. Okay. I didn't look at that. Clicker can't see. Um, okay. That was not what I was thinking about. I was thinking about maps and different things, that, but we would have to backtrack to the capital. There was something that guy uh, in the um, uh, 
Weapons way, I need pills. Is that what I need? 50? I have decreases weapons way. Um, and no, what I was looking at was this stuff. There was that's this guy back at the QZ zone, uh, and that was, um. Dang it. Um, back here. Infestation. Safest route to checkpoint Charlie South Patrol. Thought there was a quarantine zone here. West Patrol, hostile camp. Uh, okay, never mind. I was thinking that it might be worth a trip back to find Frank. Why did I go right? <clears throat> My sons told me a long time ago, whenever you're in a dungeon, always go left first. <laughs> Whoa, look. What'd you find? Fireflies. I mean, real fireflies. Oh, yeah. I see that. Oh, yeah. Okay, honey. I was the same way the first time I saw fireflies. And we, we, we caught them and put them in jars, you know. And uh, anyway, uh, I, who, who cares? Okay. Um, that's way too... Pe what do we got here? Okay. What gap are we talking about? This gap? Um, yes. But I can't climb it. Why did it have me put it there? Uh, gap. So, I can't climb it. Okay. <laughs> um, so we have to get up. Over the barbed wire. A gap. We need. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Um, let's put this down. <laughs> Hitting the tree branches. How realistic is that? Okay, let's put this down for a second. Let's jump up on this. Jump up on this. Carry this. There we go. Voila. I'm um, sweetheart. Up here. There you go. That a girl. Come on. Do I have to reach down? Come on. Uh, 
She can't make the jump. Well, here, can I boost her? Oh, crap. She can't do that. Okay. What is this? So Wop. Oh, that sucker's got us. Yeah. Upgrade melee weapon. There's a t tutorial about it. Okay. So, now... Another step. Um, oh, she made it. Now you make it. You know, girl, you just making me work hard. I was going to let put this down so she could walk up that. Can you go across, girl? Can you... Here. Can you do that? Can you do that? Look at it. Look at what? Hey, you, Bill. Where? Where do you usually meet? Oh, now. Huh? Different places. You've never been here, have you? I know this is where he lives, but no, I ain't never been here personally. And that smoke, you think that's him? Sure as hell better be. Well, let's go check it out then. <laughs> this is such a great game, man. Down here. Watch your step. It's a good drop. Okay, my other question about that. Hey! How come the net is still intact? Oh, come on. I'm full. I am full of it. Uh, butterflies. Um, is even if they make a serum and they can do it, without, uh oh, you hear that? Wow. Jackpot. Um, killing her in the process to harvest her. You know what I mean? I'll read. Collect more pills. See if I can scrounge up some extra ammo. I only have three weeks until next drop off with Tess. Oh, Tess, man. Oh, man. Um, <clears throat> they want me to collect more pills. Well, and then pills. Is, oh, full. <laughs> no, I don't want to be full. Uh, I don't want to be full of it. Uh, what can I do? I can make another one of these? No, I can't. I can make another med kit. I can't make that. I can make another shiv. Uh, 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 listen mode. I have 20 pills, enough to make, improve my listening mode. I don't care. I want this. And I want this. I need to get to 50 pills. Gotcha. All right. Um, if I... There's nothing I can do uh, to get more bullets. Except shoot. And it looks like there's quite a bit of it there. Uh, quite a bit of ammo. That I cannot avail myself. More ammo I can't avail myself of. Uh, obviously pistol, not rifle. And I, So my rifle is useless. They gave it to me and got me all excited and then it's useless. Pills. 
supplements. Do I want to go downstairs? I hear... I hear dead people. I hear them. I ain't going out that door. No way. She's crouching. There's clickers. Damn it. They're down there. They're down there. You hear them? So we gotta go down. Yeah, we gotta go down. Bricks everywhere. A oh, shift. She is scared. Must be a good reason. Swap. Swap a brick for what? I mean, I want the brick. I, I don't know about swapping. What am I swapping it with? A bottle? We don't. <laughs> Whoopsie Daisy. Not cool. Where was that brick? Oh shit, there's two. Okay. Oh crap. No lid? 
that didn't go the way I wanted it to. Ah, uh, med kit. Um, med kit. Jam from the other side. Here, boost me up. No, that's not such a good idea. Well, I can't boost you up. How else are we gonna open it? Go around. Motor would be nice. Jump up. Crap. All right, we need something. This. No? I need something. I go back and get my plank. She is she humming to herself, thinking we could jump out of the window and get down there. Apparently not. She was like uh, singing to herself. Can I bring one of these over there? Something. <coughs> Come on, Joel, boost her up. Oh, jeez, why didn't we do this last time? Give me your foot. No, just open it. Nothing else. Sure thing. Uh, now we're separated. Careful. Okay. Hurry. Let's see. Good girl, man. Okay. Don't want to swap this? Yeah. This one is full health. Mine's not bad, and it's got spikes on it. Tommy's alive. More important, he was a firefly. You know where to take me. Okay. He lives far from here, which is why we need a car. Tommy, that was my daddy's name. Tommy Lee. From Dallas, Texas. Everybody called him T.L. Oh, great. We want some more of that. Hey, look. <laughs> gnomes. Yeah, those are the gnomes. Man, I have an art book filled with these. I always thought they were super cute. <laughs> Not fairies, though. They creep me out. All right, then. <laughs> Man, a few words. But... You notice how subtly and slowly he's warming up to her.
I want to check how many of those pill type things I have now. So I can craft another med kit. I can craft a Molotov. I can craft a Shiv. I have 30. I want to get to 50. Okay. Actually, I want to get to 100 of those kinds of things. I can craft them all the time. Um, that might come in handy, actually. What does it recall? Oh, man, then I, I end up, do I use... I want one. Put the Maltov away, son. Um, uh, this, you hear her? She's just. I'm in a happy tune. So, Tommy lives in another state, I'm guessing. What did I do that enabled me to hear that? That's what I did. There's more ammo for a pistol. No, it's rags. Well, we are cleaning up. Oh, look at that. What, Ellie? What do you see, girl? What do you see? Ah! Oh! <laughs> the turning. Would you play this before? <laughs> I had a friend that knew everything about this game. Apparently. There's this character called Angel Knives who'd... What was it? She'd punch a hole through your stomach before kicking your head off. <laughs> no, I'm never a big fan of these things. I wish I could play it. Well, uh, honey, maybe someday. Tiffany Lamp. More Tiffany Lamps. These are all Tiffany's. Busted all over the place. This was a nice little uh, pizza restaurant at one time. What did I pick up? Alcohol? Special cola. Sorry. Didn't mean to push you away. Um, they even had an outdoor patio. Those look like rags to me. Why can't we pick those up? She says, humming along. Nothing in the vehicles. I mean, there would be stuff we could get out of there. Wiring, a battery. Well, the batteries would all be dead, but. I mean, there's all kinds of useful things that we could salvage off of these vehicles. But apparently, 
we will not be able to do that. Marquis Dasad, hopefully not. Oh my goodness. Whoa. Look at this place. Yeah, lots of vinyl records. Oh look at this. Old turntables. What year is this game taking place in? I mean this is how I used to buy records. And phonograph players, stereo phonograph players, the talking boulders, a pre-apocalyptic concert, July 16, 2010. Uh, I don't think apocalyptic means what they think it means. Um, that word, apocalypse has changed meaning from when I first heard the word like 50 years ago. It doesn't mean what people think it means anymore. Post-apocalyptic concert. <laughs> oh, shit. Who did that? A bit paranoid, maybe? No, that's putting it lightly. Well, I'm glad we didn't walk into it. What's the deal with this guy? Well, he helped us smuggle stuff into the city. He knows how to find things. So... Up trying to find him. Yeah. Watch your step, you'll be fine. What am I looking for? Tripwire? Yes. What kind of ammo are they giving us for this rifle? They don't say. 30 odd 6, 308 would be preferable. So I don't see any signs of his trap to give me a clue what to watch for so I don't step in one. I'm guessing tripwire. Don't tell me this is Bill. I reckon he is. Okay, it's not Bill. Now we've got arrows. We don't have a bow. We have a ladder, which we can, in fact, carry. Come here. We can use this to get over. <laughs> Who said I wanted to get over? No trespassing. I'm, I'm not sure I won't get over. I, I, I wanted to go back around out front. It's not giving me any place to place it. Roll right here. Okay, that's in place. We'll come back. I want to go check out front, Ellie. Come with me, girl. Even town without that safe. Help Brad load it into the pickup, and in case you need to get in, the combination is 5 17 21. You will be shot. So there's a pickup truck, obviously, none of these 5 17 21. 
Okay, come on, sweetheart. We can climb the ladder now. My curiosity has been quenched. No, I don't want to carry it. I want to climb it. Come on, Ellie. So Bob set all of this up. Clear, come on up. All right. Well, now we need a plank. Oh, man. All right, stay here, Ellie. I'm coming right back. Down, boy, down. I didn't tell you to stop. So Bob made it real hard for uh, anybody to follow him or anything to follow him. And now my brother's name is Bob. So we got my daddy's name in here and Tom, Tommy. And we got my brother's name in here, Robert. Clicker? Shit. What the hell is that? Different kind of clicker. Um, let's do this. Suck on this. Listen, Bill ain't exactly the most stable of individuals. So when we get there, you let me do the talking. You understand? I understand. Okay. You gotta be clear on this. He, he don't take too kindly to strangers. All right. Bill's a good guy. He just definitely needs some time warming up to you. I'm trying to figure out how we're going to get up there. A ladder? Can Ellie make that? Yeah, Ellie can't make that. She's way over yonder. Ah, uh, Ellie can't make that. And I'm wrong. Way to go, girl. So Bill. how to protect himself. <laughs> Trip wire. I 
did not hear anything. Can't help go away. What do you hear, girl? What do you hear? Oh, I hear it. Uh-oh. Whatever it is wants out. I'm not sure I want it to come out. Ah. <laughs> uh, how crazy am I? I'm crazy. You gonna go in there? I wanna see what we can find. You're gonna find my body when I die from a heart attack. Don't worry. I got this. I'm glad you think so. Upstairs, whatever it is. Made a lot of noise. Jeez, that thing scared the shit out of me. That makes two of us. While we're here, let's search the place. Coffee would be good. Speaking of which, I might just go make myself a cup, um, a pot. Now I forgot the combination to that truck. What was it? I, I suppose we have it. Ezra wrote, Rachel, soldiers of Going door to door, forcing people onto buses. I hear yelling. A couple of buildings down. Time's running out. I tried calling, waiting. I don't know what to do, but I can't wait anymore. I've thrown most of our stuff into a couple of suitcases. I'll be waiting for you in the quarantine zone. Come find me. I'll see you soon, Ezra. Rachel. Rachel? You think they ever found each other? The hell would I know? I, I'd like to think they did. Well, I, I kind of think that Ezra is right there on the floor, honey. <laughs> you hear that? I heard it. Something made a sound downstairs. Yeah, unfortunately, Ellie, Ezra never got out of the house.
we've got a trip wire over here. We could use that to our advantage if we get chased. We just have to make sure we run under it. And whatever is chasing us hits that sucker's chest high. Not our truck. Tripwire. Oh, sheet double tripwire. Um, I mean, I could throw a brick at it, maybe. Stand back. All right. Oh, shit. These things are kind of awesome. That's one way to do it. <laughs> Got them both. Jeez. All right, watch your step. Another one. Get back. Oh. I might need another brick. Thought it was a lizard. Uh, Just stay close. Stupid traps. There, that fridge, it looks like that's a counterweight. Okay. A headshot. I hit a headshot. Come on. What is she? Are they on her? Are they on Ellie? I was a headshot. Those are headshots. Possibly survive that. How many more you got?
Come on, you can do it. I can't reload when I'm upside down. Damn it. They're on Ellie. I shot Ellie by mistake. I shot Ellie by mistake. Smoke him if you got him. I'm taking a break. That was a little bit too much to do all over again right now. I'll be right back. Okay, it is almost 3 o'clock in the morning in real life. 2.45 a.m. I just made some coffee. <laughs> so help me, if they put me back hanging upside down, I'm not going to be a happy camper. Now, put me back after he falls on the ground, I'm going to run. Which one of these buttons is L2? The bottom one. Got to had to get my flashlight out to look at it. Let me turn the air conditioner off here and uh, psych up for this. Yeah, I had to have that AC running while I was making the coffee because it was 80 degrees in here. All right. <sighs> We are in the Mojave Desert in the summertime. It does not cool off much at night. All right. Let's see where that's let's see where the dirty dogs put me. Are you running, son? No, I said I pushed I push I'm pushing L1. I'm pushing L1. Why didn't he L2? Why wasn't he running? L2. L Did I was I pushing the wrong dang button? I'm holding. I'm holding L2 to sprint out of there. And he draws his weapon. So how do I get him out? Run, you sucker. Run, run. I'm pushing L2. Fucking run. Well, I didn't have to run. And of course, I'm out of ammo. That's figures. Jeez Louise. Uh, well, fine. We'll cut through here? Where? Where do you cut? Die! Cut through where? Here? I can't cut through here. Cut through where? Did he cut through? Oh, here. Stop crouching and run. I said, run! Damn it, I'm pushing L2. Run! Don't 
Why do you switch weapons? Well, I'm trying to run. And he draws his weapon. I can't kill this thing. Okay, which way am I supposed to run? And why would he run when I push L2 and he draws his weapon? Counting on you. It's over there. Do I have a shiv? Can we get out? No, I want to reload my weapon. How do we get out? Anybody? Somebody. There's a runner out there. And I have nothing. I don't have a Molotov. Can I make a Molotov? Can I make a Molotov? that bad. Turn around. All right. Get on your knees. Don't test me. Just take it easy. Right. Told her not to talk to him. Oh, God damn it. I'm clean. I see so much as a girl. Ow! Stop. Son of a bitch. What a girl. You done? Am I done? You come into my house. You set off all my traps. You damn near break my shooting arm. Who the fuck is this punk and what's she doing here? I am none of your goddamn business, and we're here because you owe Joel some favors. Whoa! So take your knees off. I owe Joel some favors, a joke. I'll cut to the chase. I need a car. Well, it is a joke. <laughs> Joel needs a car. Well, if I had one that works, which I sure as hell don't, what makes you think I'd just give it to you? Huh? Yeah, sure, Joel. Go ahead. Take my car. Take all my food, too, while you're at it. By the looks of it, you could lose some of that food. Hey! hey. Oh, shit. No, fuck you! You handcuffed I me. need you to shut up. Oh, he, he told you that before we came in here. Whatever favors you think I owe you ain't worth that much. Actually, Bill, they are. Well, it don't matter because I don't have a car that works. But there is one in this town. Parts. There are parts in this town. Meaning that you could fix one up. All right. 
We're gonna do this. There's some gear I'm gonna need. All right. It's on the other side of town. Now you help me go gather it, and maybe I can put something together that runs. But after this, I owe you nothing. That's fine. A couple days from now, we'll probably be dead anyway. Good. Follow me. This whole goddamn town's booby trapped. Gonna stay right on my ass. And knock it off. Can't miss it. And that will be on the next episode because it is 2.54 a.m. And I, in spite of having a cup of coffee, need to go rest. Well, actually, I need to put the video together and export it and, you know, upload it and have it processed and all that kind of nonsense. So, uh, thank you very much for watching. That was a kick. That was a kick. I had a great time. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, thank you all for the, the tips. And, and for some reason, he can't. I'm hitting L2 to make him sprint. But he won't sprint when he has a weapon in his hand, apparently. I didn't know how to get the weapon out of his hand. I don't know why he wouldn't sprint when I'm hitting L2. Anyway, that was fun. And it's getting better and better and better. And um, <clears throat> I don't know if I ever finished my thought about, like, once they make this serum is how they're going to distribute it worldwide. I never did finish my thought on that. But anyway, um, <clears throat> they got problems uh, way beyond uh, figuring out how to make a serum out of Ellie's blood or whatever. Anyway, what a great game. Thank you all for watching. Um, Y'all take care of yourself. I got a couple hours of work to do here so I can get this thing up. Uh, and it won't be available until probably noon tomorrow. Thank you all so much. Take care. We'll see you on the next one where we'll go uh, with Bill and get auto parts and <laughs> get a vehicle running. This is so good, man. See you on the next one.